friends! I have a special friend here with me today. His name's Dudley the dog. Can you say hello, Dudley? Hello. Why, Dudley, you look a little sad. Are you okay? I am a little sad today. What's the matter, Dudley? Well, I have to do a painting for school, but I don't want to. Why don't you want to paint, Dudley? D painting can be fun. Well, when I paint, I mess up a lot and make lots of mistakes. Mm. A lot of people feel that way about their paintings, but you know what, Dudley? What? Well, I'm going to tell you a little secret. In art, there are no mistakes. Everybody's paintings look different, and they're all beautiful in their own way. Really? Yeah. You know what? I have a book that might help you. It's about all different kinds of art and artists and how they're all special and beautiful. Would you like to hear it? Sure. Okay, you sit over here and I'll read it to you and our friends. It's called Let's Paint. And it's got a picture of an artist on the front with his paint and a puppy dog painting with its tail. That's funny. Are you keen to paint pictures but afraid of making mistakes? Well, it's not really as hard as you may think. In fact, there are no mistakes in painting. You can't mess up because there's no mistakes in art. To start with, you need an idea of what you want to paint. It can be anything you like. All ideas are good. What do you like to paint? I like to paint pictures of the ocean. Ideas can be very tiny and delicate, like that little green spot. Or they can be round and juicy, like that big ball. And some have to be held onto, onto very tight or they will blow away. Look at that painting so swirly and blowing away. There, I, there are ideas that come, you uninvited in a dream and ideas that need tender care to make them grow. Look, he's dreaming about a painting of a bone. Do you ever dream about art or something that you want to paint? Whatever idea you have, it's yours and so it's very valuable. Now that you have your idea, let's get ready and see how other artists paint their pictures. Hooray! Some painters start with big swirls of paint. See those colorful swirls? Some only use big swirls of paint. Look at that, it takes up a whole room. Others like to go outside and paint landscapes. That artist is painting a picture of outside. That must be fun. Some artists take their time and are very calm. Some artists don't and aren't. They're throwing the paint at the canvas. That looks like a lot of fun. Messy though. Might not want to do that in your house. There are people who like to experiment and play and people who plan every brush stroke. If your picture doesn't look right at first, that's okay. It m might make you cross. I get a little angry at first because it's hard. Or you might feel a bit scared or worried. You won't be the only one who feels like that. And it's completely normal to be shy or embarrassed too. And remember this. It doesn't matter what you do, there's no right or wrong way. What's important though is that you have fun. And they painted have fun in all those pretty colors. That was a fun story. What did you think, Dudley? Oh, I like that story. It gave me some great ideas for painting. Isn't it cool how art can come in all different forms? Yeah, and it's normal to be a little scared at first, but the more you practice, the more fun you'll have. That's right. What do you think you might paint a picture of now? 
Mm, I'm going to try painting some big swirls in all different colors. Ooh, that sounds like fun. Do you think our friends would like to try painting too? Oh yeah, you should try it. Remember, the more you practice, the more fun you'll have. And there's no mistakes in art. We hope you have fun. Bye!